I have a pack of ground beef and I am going to cook it two ways. Here I am going to make meatballs and in here I am going to make deconstructed cabbage rolls. I begin by sauteing the onion with sesame oil and salt for the cabbage rolls. I peel the garlic and I am going to mince it finely, half of it for the meatball, half for the cabbage rolls. And then for the meatballs, I am going to add uh, some Romano, Italian breadcrumbs, ketchup, paprika, some mushrooms, and some chili powder and salt and pepper. The onions have softened, so now I added the garlic, and now I am going to add three quarters of a cup of rice. But first I have to rinse it. I am toasting the rice, and I am adding some spices coriander, paprika, and some chili powder. I am adding a little bit of black pepper and after five minutes the rice it's nicely toasted. I just take it off the heat and let it cool. Back to the meatballs. So I have ketchup, mushrooms, garlic, breadcrumbs, egg, salt and pepper. And here I grated some of the Romano cheese. Into the oven at 375. And now I am ready to get back to the cabbage rolls. I have in here one container of sauerkraut and I drained the liquid. I put half of it at the bottom and now I am going to put the meat mixture and then I will put the thinned out pasta sauce. Now I put half of the tomato sauce on top and then the rest of the cabbage. I am going to cover it with some aluminum foil and it's ready to be baked. And now let's check on the meatballs. They need to be flipped. The meatballs are done. So I can just try one. So great. The deconstructed cabbage rolls are done. I just had a portion here. And I tasted them. They're really nice.